Welcome back to Pokemon White. It's been a few days. I, well, it's been about a week and a half for me. I have no idea where we are. And let's launch that. Okay. So, who do we have on our team? We've got Kraken, who is a little bit short on health, but he does have his heal item. Alright, so Kraken and Sobek, the power pick couple. They, between the two of them, yeah, we just picked up Poison Jab, which makes Kraken very, very dangerous. Uh, we've got Mr. Mime with Soundproof, and we just gave him Charge Beam, as well as our reliable Gaia. We've got Juno. So this is our new Caesar Pursuit, Bullet Punch, Fury Cutter, and Wing Attack. The Insect Plate Boosting Fury Cutter. We've got Sphinx with Bite, Fake Out, Fury Swipes, and Power Gem with Technician, so any move that's under 60 power gets boosted by 50%. So this is actually a 90 power Bite, a 60 power Fake Out, a 24 power, no, 27 power each hit, Fury Swipes, and Power Gem stays 70. All right, so I have no idea where we are. <laughs> Let's take a look at our map. Uh, um, map. Izzy, I figured out a bug for in. Uh... All right, so we are on Route Teve Seven there, the Celestial Tower. Oh, it's the Ghost Tower for this uh, world. And we also have a. Oh, that's where Anvil Town is. Okay. There's Mistrellion Cave, Twist Mountain, and I don't think we were able to get into Mistrellion Cave till we have Surf, so we still have a capture there. I haven't caught anything on Twist Mountain. Did we catch anything on Route 7? I think we have. I wouldn't be sitting in the middle of a grass patch if we hadn't caught something already. Um, well, it looks like we're starting with a battle, because I forgot. Oh, and it's a Cresselia! Would a Cresselia know absolutely anything that would hurt a so or hurt Sobek? I think they're mostly just pure psychic moves, right? Yep. Just about, I think. So one thing I like about the Kraken and Sobek pair is they do have complete resistance to psychic. Right, you can safeguard yourself, that's perfectly fine. It doesn't have any counters or anything. So we should just be able to crunch it. Double team, that's fine. And we'll finish off with a Shadow Claw. Ooh, Shadow Claw is kind of an interesting little animation. There's Sobex Moxie. Alright. Oh, come on, let me get off onto the road, really? I'm just gonna run from this one. So, the beauty, beauty is, it is a useful thing, now that I allowed myself the freedom to get those repels, because I think I'm gonna need them in this grass area. <laughs> Alright, so, are we even remotely close? I think there was a healing hut nearby? I think it was just south of us? Yeah, because there's the triple battle guy, that's where we left off. Let's heal up a little bit. Oh, I don't want to trade a Boldor for your Amolga. Um, aren't you the healing hut? I thought you were the healing hut. Oh, it's autumn. Wow. Okay. I go inside the house and I come back and the season's changed. Wow. Yeah, that's normal. Okay. You know, because that's how seasons work. Just be glad it doesn't change how it doesn't those change those change a lot faster than normal. All right, am I even remotely close to somewhere where I'm like people who are more experienced at this game than I am? Am I remotely close to somewhere useful? 
Because I'm almost to know. Icarus. Oh, that's Icarus City. Okay, that's a city. But do I have to go through Twist Mountain to get there? I don't. Maybe. And then I need to turn my dust machine back on there. Have I fought you? I apparently have not. Yay. Alright, let's get back in the swing of things with battles. Staring at code too much this week, so I needed something to distract me a little bit. Ooh, Onyx. Unfortunately for Onyx, not the best matchup against Kraken. I think I actually have, yep, Water Pulse. Goodbye, Onyx. Oh, freaking sturdy. Oh, he got confused. He's gonna punch himself and kill himself. Come on, kill yourself. <laughs> Your sturdy does nothing with confusion. Oh, that's good. And I heal up with my black sludge. Oh my god, it's a Wobbuffet. Uh, better switch out your, uh, Kraken. Alright, is Sobek gonna be able to handle this? I don't have weak moves on him. It's a female Wobbuffet. Can I take him down with one hit with Crunch? I mean, if I don't hit him with one hit, I'm pretty much dead, isn't it? Or do I want to try weak moves? Which Kraken doesn't... Or Sobek doesn't have. Oh, I don't want to lose either one of these guys. These are the power pair. If I don't kill the Wobbuffet, it's going to kill me. Oh, okay. How am I going to do this? Now, Wobbuffet is Psychic type? Normal type. Psychic. Okay. So the better way to do it would actually be go back to Sobek, or go back to Kraken and Poison Jab. Because Poison will be not effective, and thus will do... Can't be switched out. Oh, you son of a bitch, you have that lock-on skill. Okay. Okay. We can deal with this. Um... Go big or go home, or how do we want to do this? Boba Fett's have a lot of HP. Um, so basically, it looks like my options are Stone Edge, because it's not going to do a ton of damage, but it'll do a lot. No, because if I do more than 60 damage to it, I'll insta-die. Or I can use Dig. How do I will it down? I built Sobek to be a lean, mean, killing machine. None of his moves are weak. I know it can't one-shot me if I do it in small damage amounts, but I don't have anything that does small damage amounts and I can't switch back to... Um, Kraken. <sighs> Sobek, buddy. I love you. You probably I'd are one of my... Yeah, you're probably one of my favorites on the current team. Please don't die. Please use, like, Mirror Code or some shit. Die, 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 die! Oh my god, it has one HP left. Really? Please Safeguard. Don't use... Yay, Sobek lives! Okay. Still has a chance of killing me if it Destiny Bonds, because that has priority, or no? Ah, there we go. Okay! I had heart attack over. That's a great way to come back after a small hiatus. <laughs> Freaking Wobbuffets. Like, I'd rather have legendaries to fight than Wobbuffets. At least the legendaries will just out and out kill you. The Wobbuffets are like, Am I going to kill you now? No, I'm just going to be trolly. Going to kill you now? <laughs> Maybe not. Now I'm going to kill you. Alright, a Weeping Bell. Um, Same with Shuckles. Now, Weeping Bell is part poison, if I remember correctly. Yes, poison grass. Alright, so that means I'm just actually going to stick in with it. 
And I just need to hit it hard. Um, just crunch, I guess. Whew. Okay, that... That, that was a... Wow. That was a hell of a fight. What do you let your hat Pokemon have? What is their style? Their, their, their style is not dying. And they're doing a moderately decent job of it now. Okay. Um, the question is, do I want to put some other team in? I think Juno and Sync should come in for a bit. I mean, they got some pretty good skills. I really want to see how well Juno and Sphinx do. I think I'm going to put Sphinx in front. And I don't want to get him too low level, too high level on the other main pair. Hermes is currently powering up via the EXP share at the moment. Alright, please don't have a Legendary because I don't think these guys can actually take out a Legendary. <laughs> and that is like freaking uh, Groudon. Alright, Pokemon Rainer, Pedro, Fulpix. Alright. That's actually bad for Caesar. Yeah, but I'm not starting with Caesar, I'm starting with Sphinx. Okay, we have. Oh, we, we gotta use Fake Out, because that guarantees they can't move the first turn, right? Plus, Technician will power it up. Because that. Oh, wow, that nearly one shot Vulpix. Okay, I didn't realize Fake Out was that good. And then let's try the Fury Swipes that's powered up by Technicians. Ah, oh, he dodged it. Imprison. Alright, um, I don't think any of Vulpix's moves will be shared by me except maybe Bite. God, stop dodging it! Will-O-Wisp. No! You're burned! Bad Sphinx. Alright, that's 10 damage a turn. Come on. One more Fury Swipes and I can switch you out, buddy. There we go. Okay, Fury Swipes does very, very little damage. But it does help. Alright. Let's get you... Ow, that burn is hurting. Yeah, let's get you out so we can heal you. About to send in Skitty. Will you switch your Pokemon? Sure. Alright, Juno, you can handle a Skitty. Everyone's hoping for legendaries and they get a Skitty. <laughs> Alright, so Fury Cutter becomes more and more powerful every time we use it. So let's start by powering up on this Skitty so we can handle whatever their next Pokemon is, if they have one. Faint attack, alright. Not gonna do much. We might actually kill it this time if we keep powering up. I don't know what the power up rate is like. Yep, damn. Oh, they didn't have a third, okay. Asperberry. I'm hoping those Asperberries are Burn Heal. I don't think they are. It, it, does Burn persist at Burn? It does persist after battle. Alright. Um, bag. Uh, what do we got for I don't think it. I don't think Burn you don't persists take damage after you battle. Walk, burn does persist. Persist? It keeps on it, but it doesn't as you walk. Yeah, it doesn't oh, yeah, damage yeah. as you walk, but okay. I needed to heal it from the Burn. Oh, is this... Let's see. Celestial Tower, place of rest for innocent spirits. Um, is there... Dead Pokemon live there. Yeah, where's the city? I know I don't have to go through Celestial Tower to get to a city. Ooh, and there's loot over here. Loot! Stardust. Nice. Oh, where'd my... Let's get my radar back up. Easy, thank you. And there's the city right off to the side. I knew there was a city up here somewhere. Looks like I have to walk on the balance beam to get to the city. Alright. I like these so much better than the bike ones. Or is this the halfway Healy house? Hopefully this is the halfway Healy house. Please, one of you be a healer. Yes! The halfway Healy house! Since her yammering stops while she's cooking, it's another bonus for me. Wow! Wow! Pokemon! Promoting healthy relationships since 1995. 
Wow. Camel's wheels are always nothing but vegetables. Do you have anything else to say, old timer? Nope. Wow. Old folks say the darndest things. And also, you're not letting me get to the trash can, which is becoming an issue, people. Uh. Alright, so we have a halfway healing house. Let's go up this tower. We've got a huge number of Pokemon that should be honored. And this is always a very, very emotional time for Nuzlocke players, because... In almost all, all other game playthroughs for Pokemon, you don't actually have things die permanently. What died? I don't know, nine or ten of my team already? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so ring the bell at the top and it pleases the spirits. These graves say anything? Is there loot in them? Be funny I didn't bring my run. shovel. <laughs> so, Beck, dig down into these graves, see if there's any loot down there. You know what be, would be the greatest thing is if each grave was labeled with the Pokemon, one of your Pokemon that is in the grave. Or just a name of a trainer and a Pokemon they released or something. Like, that'd be kind of cool. Okay, you're gonna stop me from getting loot, and it looks like you're trying to pull a double battle. No, you're not. Okay. Although you are blocking me from my loot. Alright, Psychic Dorian sent out a Skarmory. Well, shit. That luck. is just about the worst possible thing that we could have had come out. Um, Power Gem is going to be okay go. against it, or no? What one? Yeah. Skarmory. Power Gem will, Power uh, gem will be okay It's against. going to be normal. Be okay. Alright, and Bite. I, do you Steel types resist, Dark? Uh, yes. Alright, well, we might as well use Fake Out, because that's a free move. It's not going to do any damage, but it's a free move. Okay. So, yeah, I think I don't want to switch out to Caesar because he actually has a direct weakness to the flying type. I don't, I don't want to learn... Just because this is a tower where people bury their Pokemon, I don't want to walk in here and bury my team. I don't think that uh, most of uh, Skarmory's moves are not flying, I think. It does have it wing attack. I know though. it learns a couple flying moves. Sw spikes? Oh god, spikes. All right. Spikes are on switch in, so we're not switching. Just keep pounding away with that power gem. Oh my god, how many layers of spikes is he gonna put? Yeah, we are not switching in with this many spikes on the field. Air cutter. So, yep, see, there's an air move. Alright, does not do a lot to Sphinx. Nice. Glad we taught Sphinx a rock move. That was a very good plan whenever we had that. <laughs> Aw, sending in a cute little Eevee. I'm gonna keep battling. Hello, little Eevee. Hello. Time to send you to the grave. And we're gonna fake you out. Oh, it's only the first time I come out, not when they come out. Ow, this Eevee hits hard. Um, three <laughs> swipes? Or bite? Which is better? I think bite, because I get the technician bonus on it. Oh, this uh, Eevee hits to get the really hard. Okay, we Fury need Fury swipes is probably better. Because you get a technician bonus for each hit. True. Um, Moo Moo Help Milk is... What, is Freshwater 50? Um, yeah, Moo Moo Milk it is. I'd like to pet the Eevee. I'll pet the Eevee many times with Fury swipes. <laughs> <laughs> Ow, you little critting bastard. Yeah, you're gonna get petted so hard with these fury swipes. <laughs> Ow. Scratch its eyeballs out. And I missed. Okay, well, it looks like we're healing again. I'm burning through all of my healing items against an Eevee. <laughs> that, that's pretty... That just shows how bad a Persian actually is. Well, it's just because this Persian has zero Eevees. As well, against an Eevee. 
Like, this is the first time I think Sphinx has been used in battle. All the rest of the levels have come off that EXP share. Oh, wow. Okay, Fury Swipes just wrecks when they're not resistant to it. Well, they also, like I said, technician. They get Stab moves. and Technician. Alright, Armaldo coming out. That is Bug Rock? Yes, Bug Rock. That's actually beneficial because I can use my Rock Attack against it for Stab. Or not Stab, but 2x effective. Bonus. No, that's normal because uh, no. Steel res or It's not Steel, it's no, Rock. Wait. Rock doesn't yeah. resist Rock, so it's going to do bonus. It's super effective, yeah. Metal Claw. Ow. Just a little bit. I don't want to use Fury Swipes. I could use Bite. I think Bite might be more powerful. I don't know. Nah, it's a power jam, I think. We'll stick with it. Ah, oh, stop dodging! One sand attack by that Eevee is gonna wreck me. Oh my god, we gotta heal again. Alright, let's use the fresh water. Yeah, and I, and I have Silk Scarf on. So, I mean, I should be getting crazy bonuses to my normal attacks. Um, Alright, let's try a Bite. Bite is way more accurate. Oh, really protect? You're, you're really gonna bring it to this. You got Rest in that move repertoire as well? Oh, Water Gun. Great, now it's a Wet Cat. Feel the fury of a Wet Cat. <laughs> nope, it's gonna protect again. God damn it. Okay, Sphinx can't hit anything. And Sphinx is about to die. Caesar is probably not a bad idea. Oh wait, Caesar! Ju does Caesar? Does Juno count as flying? I'm hoping the spikes won't do a lot of damage. No, he, uh... Okay, it didn't hurt that much. 15 damage with the spikes. I was way more worried about those than I should have been. And now I'm gonna resist the metal attacks. And I have bullet punch, which will really hurt right back. There we go. Your water gun does nothing to a steel. There we are. Stop using protect! Okay, so what are the moves that break through protect? Because I'm really, really wanting some of those. I, I can't remember it. I'm sorry. Is it brick break or something that goes through? Brick no. break breaks uh, it's the... It's not uh, brick break. It only breaks, like, screens. Like screen, light screen in them. Okay, there's got to be something that goes through protect, unless protect is just there is. invincible. There is moves that go through protect. Right, I'm gonna go heal up real I quick. I just can't remember them right now. 